Hi everyone, welcome back to another episode of Princess SMP. I am here, Maho Maddie, playing the Princess Maholia of the Elven Kingdom. And I'm here standing on my balcony and I see a lovely stable in the distance that looks like it's almost finished, nearly finished. It's a lot bigger than I was thinking it would be, but that's perfectly fine. I'm very excited to see it. And then also, I have um, informed Captain Craig that he can start filling in the lumber shop, and it looks like I kind of see that there has been some things that he has added, so I kind of want to go check it out. Out. I also really need to talk to the mermaid princess and update her on all of the things that happened at the princess meeting. So I will be visiting her today as well um, without Kano. <laughs> I think, you know, I'm doing pretty good at being a princess. I feel like it's probably just in my blood. So I think I can probably handle it myself i'm gonna give it my best shot let's go down and see how our subjects are doing we can check in with captain craig and the lumber shop i don't know why i decided to do this at night time but hopefully since i've been sleeping really well it won't be a problem hello, hello princess Hi, I came to check in and see how things are going. I see that you have placed some things around, some decoration. Yes, I had Charlotte help me out with that. What about the stock inside? Uh, the stock, currently, we only have a few things, but not wow. plenty. No, this is great. But I... Oh, I see. I, you only have um some things in stock, but you've... You've decorated the inside, and I see you have a setup for all the other ones. Uh, I'm just, great. I'm still working on the pricing for everything, so. Yeah, no problem. If you see, if you see fit to change anything, then do let me know. Okay, well, it, is this money going towards you or towards me? What were you thinking? Because I was thinking uh, all of this payment would go towards you, since you are the one gathering the materials. Still thinking on that. I might do a fifty-fifty split. No, you don't, I, you, I'm telling you, you don't have to. Like, if you were thinking uh -oh. that you were going to be giving me compensation, I will be using the money from the castle to purchase your wood. Oh, okay. Well, you've been, you've been also... so generous with building materials, so I feel like at some point I should compensate you. Well, that's only if you see fit. I will eventually put together a royal shop that you can buy things from the castle to like circulate the economy if that makes sense to you yeah all right that sounds good okay so currently still working on the stock but should be filled within the, the next few okay i like how you have these as put as diamonds is it because it's so much work to put together yes <laughs> sorry i apologize for making you make all that green wood but at least no, you have fine. a very beautiful shop right yeah, thank you. You're and welcome. I do have a question for you. Yes. So there's a wood called glow logs. Okay. And I do need glowstone dust. Oh. Well, you know what? I think I have some blocks of glowstone that I have okay. found that I can provide for you right now. Um, as far as glowstone dust, I think I'll have to put in an order with the nether. Right. And if need be, I can help pay for or help trade what they want yes all right i appreciate it no problem thank you and the shop is looking lovely thank you all right i think i'm going to go get the glowstone first and then i might just show up at the mermaid kingdom do i have my i do okay so i will head on over there I am pretty sure that Kano still has the book and the key, so I unfortunately can't show them what I have or verify that they have the same thing, but I can double check Kano's room just in case. 
But first, I'm gonna double check for that glowstone. It may possibly be in my room, but I'm pretty sure I brought it down here. I do have it. All right, I'll drop that off with Captain Craig, and then I'll make my way to the Mermaid Kingdom. Hello, doggies. I can't wait for Kano to name you. I wonder what he names he's gonna give you all. Um, I highly doubt that he would just set it down. Oh, he did. Oh, good. I'm glad he did that. Okay. All right, Craig. Hmm? Captain, I have the glowstone for you. Oh, thank you very much. You're princess. very welcome. All right, have fun doing whatever you said you have business doing. <laughs> yes. Do you want to accompany right. me? Uh, I mean, only if you see fit that I should. I think, actually, I think it's all right. I think I'll be okay. All right, well, let me know if you do need anything, and I'll be right there. Okay, I will. All right. Here we are. And since I have the necklace on, I should be able to just plop in the water. To the Mermaid Kingdom. It's so pretty down here. Look at that! Wow! It's so pretty down here. Okay, maybe I should call. Hello? You don't need a break. <laughs> you know Hello? Saying, you're, you know the saying like oh, you get a rest when you're dead? Oh, Hello? <laughs> Hello? Sorry to intrude. Hello? I'm trying to... Where is everyone? <laughs> oh, hi! We were trying to find where you went. <laughs> You're using it. I oh, am. Yay. yay. Hi, Princess Coral. Nice to see you again. Hi. And Princess Marina. Hello. <laughs> and um, your advisor's name, remind me, Jonah, was it? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Okay, nice to see you again, too. Pleasure to see you, too. Pleasure to see you, too. And I don't think oh, I've officially princess. met oh, there we go. these two. Yes, I am the Night Captain Ziff. At your service. Nice to meet you. And I'm the vice captain, Quinn. Nice to meet you both. Wow, I'm getting yes. the whole royal entourage today, it seems yes. like. Yes! <laughs> yes. I might want to tell you in private, and then we can discuss it in front. It'll right. be your decision, because yeah. I don't know if you might, you might not want everybody to hear this. Do you want to join in on this, advisor? It is, what I, it is whatever you would like to do. Okay, cool. Yep. No. <laughs> What yes. Does that mean? Uh, uh, no, the advisor will join in. Yes. Okay. So maybe we'll uh, swim away privately, and then we'll come back um, yes. if your princess decides to share this information with you. All right. Okay. All right. Okay. We'll be back. Okay. All right. Sorry. Uh, you lead the way. I'm not as fast as you both. The tail looks very lovely. <laughs> Thank you. I've been enjoying it so much. It's so fun. So you found a book. That was called Find I Me. did. So yes. all of the princesses have received the same book. Um, do oh, your really? coordinates say 32861 negative 2582? They do. Yes. And then so, I had this. Yes. Um, I it's also have Mermaid one. Key. That's his elven key. And so do all the other princesses. So that is what we met oh. about. Um and talked about the nether princess said that she traveled in the nether in those same coordinates and there was nothing mm -hmm. there oh. They've all been to the same spot the iceberg and yeah. have found nothing digging for hours it seems like the seraphs were doing yeah. as well as us and found nothing we've decided that the last place that we could check is the end oh so, in about two weeks' time, we, the Elven Kingdom will be leading an expedition to the end um, to see if we can mm -hmm. travel to these coordinates and if we find whoever this book was written by, as well as find use for whatever this key unlocks. So, we are yeah. inviting you to come with. I understand for mermaids that it's definitely a dangerous mission. You might want to send a representative and not yourself. And you might want to limit who goes as well. Right. Certainly you do not want your heirs dying in the end. No. 
definitely something I'll have to talk to my people about. Yes. But we'll make sure, um, as I was saying, we'll make sure the Elven Kingdom will have preparations to make sure that everything is strategic for if, like, you were to... Well, thankfully, we can place water down there for emergencies. Yes. We'll also have a recovery area because elves cannot regen. So we'll oh. have to have a special area where we can regen our health. Um, we don't naturally regen unless we're in a forest. So right. the worst situation that could happen is falling into the abyss. So I want to avoid that as much as possible. But if we're traveling far into the end, um, it could be quite dangerous. Have any of the other kingdoms decided if they're going or not? I'm not no to one has them. given me a definitive yeah. answer yet. Okay. Um, yeah, I haven't heard a definitive answer. All right. Okay, yeah, um, definitely have to think about it. No and... problem. I totally understand. Yeah. I will keep in touch. All right, thank you so much. Yes, thank you. Bye. Bye. All right, I think that went well. Oh, hello, dolphin. You're so cute. Home. That's done. I can go put this away somewhere safe here. What have I? I want to name my axolotls. I have the pink one ho that's hopefully still in the castle. And the new white and pink one. I also should probably upgrade my gear. I might have to end up enchanting quite a lot of things. Let's go to Kano's room and then. And we'll name this axolotl. Maybe grab the other one. Okay. Thank you, Kano. And we'll name this one Pearl. Beautiful. Such a cute name. Okay. Pearl, you better not despawn. I will be so sad. And <gasps> yay. Oh, she's so cute. I love her. Please don't find a way to despawn. <sighs> My poor other axolotls. I think I'm going to take the pink axolotl out as well. Just because the outside pond is a little bit more room. It's a little cramped in here. I feel like she spins in circles. Oops. Come here. There we go. Was Rosie the name I was going to go with? Rosie and Pearl. All right, you two better be on your best behavior. I'm already terrified. Rosie and Pearl, cute. We can't get through there, right? Okay, good. So, ooh, wow. They've been working hard over here. There's all the building materials. And there's Anthony and my horse looking great. I kind of want to look in here too. Looks like it hasn't been decorated yet, but it looks like a whole house. Maybe I will go get a sword and after I get a sword, I will go to this the skeleton spawner, try to level up a little bit and hi again. <laughs> I was just restocking the lumber shop. Okay, go for it. I'm I'm running around doing odds and ends, but all safe things. I promise. Okay. I promise. I was I was supposed to be reassuring, not suspicious. Mm. I all will right. well, I will call it. you if I need to go like mining or anything. I will call you for help. All right. Well, sounds good. Okay. I swear, I swear, I was being genuine. I was not trying to be suspicious. Although running away from Kano is quite fun. When I'm with Anthony. Anthony definitely brings out my mischievous side and I love it. I love having a brother like that. Well, it seems like Captain Craig um, informed me that we have visitors at the castle. So I better go return to the castle and see what that's about. I do have 
a lot of levels anyways. I think I have time to enchant my bow. I'm just so curious. I just really want to know if I can get something good. Although it might be more worthwhile to just enchant a book. But that takes so long. It really does. Okay. There are so many animals in here that are just tied to a post. Hello? Oh! There she is. Hi. Hello. Hello. Hi. Hi, Theo. Hello. I was just borrowing your enchantment table. I see you have visitors, mm -hmm. or are they my well, visitors? We they were yours. Okay. I was just on my way to the castle. Well, I don't think the the water quite reaches that high, so. We're on. Okay. We're, um, in the middle of trying to make a nice tunnel for you guys. We appreciate it. But um, we came here on. Less than just normal visiting matters. Okay. Coral has informed us about the uh, expedition. Okay. And we wish to be on it, whether Coral necessarily <laughs> knows about it or not. Mm. Oh, okay. So you both want to go, but you, w the princess might not know you want to go? Oh, she definitely knows she that knows we want to go. Well, it's the question of she, she doesn't have to know that we went. Oh, I she, see. She she knows Marina wants to go. I was a bit more hesitant about it. No, you were very, is. very obvious as if. I know what subtly is. Anyways. You're extremely obvious. So we just wanted a little bit of... Maybe a more... Just to see if you had a better estimation than when you planned to do this expedition. And if you were going to be one of the people actually going. I myself will go, yes. And my advisor, Kano, will also go. Um, as far as anybody else from the Elven Kingdom, I have asked, and I... Craig, did you give me an answer? Uh, I, yeah, I am going. So, my captain um, will also be joining us. I think that might be it for the Elven Kingdom, because I'll have my brother stay behind and run the kingdom in case uh, the worst uh, is to happen. Yes, I I'll also, don't... I'll also keep watch of the land. Oh, thank you, Theo. I don't know about anybody else. Nobody has given me a, an actual answer yet, so I can't tell you exactly when. But I'm sure once I find out who all is going, then we can decide together what is the best time to go. Certainly. Um, I would also like to ask logistics of this a little more. What do you mean? Are we going on multiple or just the one? And are we going straight to the coordinates or are we setting up a base camp near where we enter? I don't know. We're going to travel to the end, first of all. And mm -hmm. second of all, we'll travel to the coordinates inside of the end. I don't know if we'll do both of those things back to back. I, I don't think I want to personally step into the end ever again. So I kind of want to do it on all one go. <laughs> but I understand if people, after stepping in, decide to back out. I wouldn't. I wouldn't blame them, but... Well, I was more or less assuming that we know little about it. I would assume we want to study it a little more before we just decide to jump in and go to the coordinates, depending on how far away they are. Yes, I actually, the Winter Princess offered, she says she had a library. She might know some things. I have yet to talk to her about that specifically. She just mentioned it at the princess meeting that we had. As far as what I know about it, um, my mother, the previous princess before me, traveled to the end with a highly geared expedition, all netherite mm -hmm. armor and weapons, and did not return. So assuming that, oh. I know it is very dangerous. They could still be alive. That was over a thousand years ago. So elves live a long time. So I was just a baby when she went. <laughs> so I, oh. yeah. Wait, so. I'm sorry, but how old does that make you then? I'm a thousand and two. Oh, so you really were just. Yeah, I was like, I was two years old. So as far as anything goes about the end, nobody has traveled to it elf wise i don't know about anybody else i'm assuming the mermaids have never traveled there either 
or have desired to. I've I... only vaguely heard of the end in books. The only I... thing that they mentioned was a very specific way to get there, yes. but no one knows what that specific way to get there is. It's just there's only one way to get there. The Netherians know how to get there, and we need Ender, uh, Eyes of Ender, I believe. Eyes of Ender. Yeah. So I heard it from an old man rambling about it, so I just assumed he was a little crazy, but I guess maybe he was crazy for a reason. Yes, we need Ender's Eyes, which I believe you can obtain from the Ender Men, which makes sense because they're from the end. a couple of those. Yeah, to make make these and I believe I have one more mm. um, we've been gathering them slowly um, just grabbing any endermen that we have seen and also as far as blaze rods go we have some just from finding them um, while exploring as well so I think we'll be set to get there and I because my mother has already been there, I'm assuming that we don't have to do anything to open the portal to go. I would like to ask. Yes. If if me and Marina were were to come along, would you provide potions? I know we have some, but the, we have no clue how long we're going to be there for. And in case for some reason water runs out or doesn't work for some reason, will you be able to accommodate us i do have a lower stock of water breathing potions that i can provide i will have to coordinate with the nether princess if i want to get any more otherwise it might just be one each but i want to prepare as much as possible so i think preparing multiple mm -hmm. buckets would be a good idea and then a safe house that we can plant once we go through the portal that you can recover to that already has a infinite water source in it that way mm. you can either refill a bucket in just in case or you can just retreat to that safe house that would be smart yes my sister is uh very concerned oh i'm sure i have for good reason well, right. oh. but going with a big group it would be yeah. Um, good for us to go so we can pick each other up and help heal each other elves have the ability ability to heal other players um, it just takes mm. it takes health from us and we aren't able to regen so we will just have to um, bring either special apples with us or get regen I, potions from the nether I, um, or salad Salad. <laughs> yes, yeah. Sal salad. salad. We have discovered salad really helps uh, regen as well. Salad. <laughs> yes. So yeah, I I will Ooh, definitely help out. Stockpile of salads. I will definitely help out with the food industry in part of that whole thing. Thank you. Yes, so. we'll have to definitely prepare and also, yeah, I want to do this very carefully and thoughtfully so that nobody has any issues. I think the most dangerous part of it would be traveling physically through the area just because there is an abyss where you can fall into nothing much like space so sounds fun yes um so you so that you cannot be picked up from so that is my main concern and i'm trying to make sure or come up with a plan in case something does happen where someone does fall or maybe just avoid going towards edges as much as possible but it might not be avoidable so if you and have any ideas perhaps yes yeah, so that's i'm thinking that and the cloud kingdom might be able to provide some materials for us to be able to fly up temporarily if need be as well there there might also be some items that we can find that can help if one were to fall so but we don't know if the the teleporters work uh, in the other dimensions but if they do oh you know what i know they do because the nether oh. princess uses them so the little teleport compasses they do work yes so wow. then we should um. have people on other sides 
of areas with different compasses in case they fall off then. Yes, yeah, maybe a it's a good I- yeah, maybe it's a good idea for everybody in their kingdom to have a someone else's compass. Yeah, someone else's compass from the, um so like if you ha- two had each other's compass and then maybe Kano and I and Captain Craig will each have one cuz if you if you have too many in your inventory that might just get confusing. But mm-hmm. <laughs> Well, that's a good. That's a great idea. I like that idea a lot. We'll do that then. Um, are those fairly easy to craft? Uh, ender eyes. And okay. Diamonds. I believe gold. Okay. I believe gold. Or is there gold I think, rocks? I think gold can be substituted. Okay, that's not too bad at all. Yes, gold can be substituted. Okay. All right. Okay. Now I'm feeling much better about this. I feel like we have <laughs> ways to like <laughs> avoid death. <laughs> Um, so yeah, just gearing up, I would recommend, unfortunately we cannot have netherite, but you can do diamond armor. Um, as far as bows go, you can bring one. We have plenty of bows and arrows here at the Elven Kingdom if you would like one. uh, However, I'm worried about anybody but the (laughs) elves getting, like, I think we should be at the front just because our bow, <laughs> our arrows do so much more damage, and I have already had a couple accidents um, oh, of people yeah. walking in front of my bow. <laughs> so, um, and I don't want it to repeat either. Like full, I'm pretty sure can you know had full diamond armor, and I killed him with a regular yeah. bow. So, um, yeah, I think maybe. You can have it as backup, but we'll probably just a sword will do just fine as well. And the elves will Mm. do the bow and arrow shooting. Yeah. Like, if you guys do also need more enchants on bow and arrows, just let me know. I'm very good. That's exactly why I was here at your house. I was like, I need to enchant my bow. (laughs) (laughs) I mean, I mean, I also have extra bows that have good enchants on it so oh really oh wait what I, do you have that i fished up oh i fished up too what do, you, what do you have uh the one i fished up was actually uh power four and infinity oh and i added flame and another power book to wait it, can so i have power that power five, four flame. impressive uh, i I will get you one. Don't worry. I just want power four and infinity. I don't want flame because I'm worried about setting yeah, myself I, on fire. I, the one I have is now power five, so that's like even more damage. Okay, yeah, power. I'll that's take like it. One, I'll take it. Power. That, that's like a one tap. I just need infinity because like I always forget to put arrows in my inventory. Well, I have to put one mm-hmm. arrow, don't I? All right. Well, okay. Any more questions that you have? I'm glad to hear that you'll be joining us. That. At least we'll have as somebody. long as you know scheduling conflicts work out. You know how our duties are. Yes, I think we'll we'll make it work, especially if you guys end up being the only ones that come with us. But I'm hoping the seraphs will <laughs> be able to come with us because the seraphs will have an issue of there. falling off anywhere. <laughs> oh wait, no, they will. Why are you scared, Theo? No, totally not. Oh, he's he's definitely, he's definitely scared. Don't worry, I'll be there to protect her. I have I have lost too many people. So You have? Family. Oh. Okay. Actually, I was going to ask that. Yeah. How much do we know about what we can get from this end? Um, not I I don't know. Answers? <laughs> Um, all I know is that there are lots of Endermen there, and there's an abyss, and a book that told me, find me in coordinates. And if it's in the end, I have no idea what we're looking for. Okay. I had a theory, and this may need to be relayed to the other princesses. I could also be wrong. Okay. But, depending on, because I know our... Well, my sister's find me chest where we discovered it together was in her room. Mm -hmm. Where was yours? In my room. My thought process is perhaps the only way that these keys can be activated is with the royal. And so we should, if we're making this expedition to ensure that there is one royal from each kingdom, 
Yes, to take um, the my risk. thoughts exactly. I think the keys were meant for the princesses. Um, so that's, we'll that's see. Why if, I don't. Why it, I... It, it wouldn't be uh, particularly smart if one royal from each kingdom d and ends up <laughs> not going, and then we can't even get any further than that. So. Well, I think the ones that don't go just miss out, but I'm not sure. I don't know. I don't know what's we don't know exactly there. Yeah. We so, don't know for sure. Yeah, I don't but that, know. That is but why I... we might. We could probably ask to bring the extra keys along yeah. if, if for some reason, they abstain from coming. Well, that that is why I initially would suggest two expeditions at least, because then we can, then maybe if we come back all fine, then maybe more princesses and more people will be willing to come. And we might only get if... one shot at it, though. Yeah, I don't. That's two <laughs> times. That's two different times I could die, and I just want to have one time where I could die, and not two. <laughs> well, I mean, every time you wake up, you could die, but. Oh, Ziff. Jesus. I mean, I mean, am I wrong? Am I wrong? <laughs> Ignore my captain, please. He means well, but he's a, a bit obtuse. <laughs> well, I hope you can understand my concern since my mother never came back. So, of course. Oh, I understand. I understand. And we are concerned as well, but I think our excitement for going overshadows our concern. At least ours. <laughs> but our princess is was quite hesitant into even saying <laughs> anything. <laughs> so I know that's At this why point, I gave her the option. More than likely. But... That we will, as we snuck out of the castle just now. Oh, we're oh, likely you going to. Okay. You oh yeah, out. we snuck out. We we left. Oh. Yeah, oh, okay. yeah we snuck the, out. Um, so no, no clue we're here. I mean, oh, yeah, we they have no idea. This isn't the first time we've snuck out either. No, no, it's not, and will not be the last. <laughs> hey, it definitely won't be the last. <laughs> this no. is definitely this is definitely a safe haven for all of you guys. So. Correct. Um. Yes, we snuck out this time. More than likely, we'll have to sneak out again <laughs> for the expedition, but we will be properly defended. I know my preferred weapon in there, there will probably be our tridents. Okay. So I, If we have them. I, if we I, have I them. We, we have one so far. The farming has been difficult, but as we'll get there As long as it end. doesn't have Riptide enchantment, because I'm worried that you'll fling yourself too far. Yeah, no. At this point, the only thing logical in there so we don't fall off the edge would be loyalty. Yeah. Then it comes mm. back. Mm. Loyalty and piercing, probably. Or whatever that equivalent is. In... Right. Is it piercing? Impact. Impact. Uh, impaling. Don't, don't we have some of those? Impaling? Impaling, yes. Yes, yes, yes. That's one of those. Oh, impaling, impaling, yes. I think, yeah, I think we have some of those. Maybe oh, enchantment books? books? No. Yes. yes. Enchantment books. No, yes. Yes, no. <laughs> Maybe so. <laughs> We yes, have enchant to, we books. have to make a. We have to make sure. <laughs> well, if the day leave. comes and we don't happen to have one or the other. Yeah, I'm always definitely here to help out all the royalty that needs any equipment, anything. <laughs> I I I am too clumsy to go on any too too far expeditions. <laughs> okay. So. Yeah, well, I, I've, I've been the one that's gone out 7,000 meters by myself already, so, on land. So, you know, it's alright. Oh my goodness. Well, I'm glad you're still yeah, alive. Yeah, my sister doesn't know, and nor will she know, because if Ziff tells her, then I'll just tell, him, tell her about his shenanigans, and he doesn't want that happening. <laughs> <laughs> I have no clue you're talking about, Princess Marina. Mm. Oh, true, true. So, but yes, uh, as long as we are available... Consider us your allies for this expedition. I'm right. Thank Even if so we are sneaking out to do so. <laughs> well, I will try to keep that undercover with Princess Coral if she asks. <laughs> Correct. That would be and, smart. And there is the off chance she just lets us go. I highly doubt that. Yeah, the, the way that she was talking in the meeting because of our uh, larger amounts of deaths, it doesn't look like she wants anybody going. But um, someone should go. Yes, at least one, and if that happens Just... to be me or Prince Marina. Yeah. All right. Well, 
More than likely, it'll be both of us. Well, I'll personally make sure that I'll be able to bring both of you back to the Mermaid Kingdom. Thank you. Oh, that is a nice sentiment. Thank you. <laughs> I, I definitely don't want to be delivering messages to people who have Well, yes, perished. hopefully you won't have to deliver a message of my death. And that's what I'm most worried I, about, actually. Because I, I, I'll be... As much I'm as I am close yeah, with I'm my just brother, I just... What um, your brother would I, say. I, I, I'm just worried about the state of the kingdom if he were yeah. to run it. Oh, dear. <laughs> definitely worried (laughs) but let's think positively it could be good we just have to stay alert and prepared and together and hope that it's not just the five of us going and not shooting anyone on accident okay but i can (laughs) yes 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 no shooting yes i'll I'll really make sure there's nobody standing in front of me (laughs) that's my is, is this my reputation already? <laughs> well, we had no one by until we came over here, so maybe just amongst your people. My people don't stop talking about it, so. <laughs> don't worry, I won't stop talking about it either. I mean, what? Uh, oh, yes, great. stop. Lovely. No, no, no. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. But yes, we figured we'd come and ask ourselves and uh, discuss before coral noses were gone. So, we should probably get back. Yes, good idea. Yes, yes, yes we probably should go. Alright, and your Not secret is safe with me. Good, good. It was lovely to meet both of you, by the way. Mm-hmm. Of course. Of and course. lovely to meet you, Your Highness. Lovely to see <laughs> you again. Thank you for coming and letting me know. You're welcome. Safe Bye, travels everybody. back home. Bye. 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 Oh, it's raining. We would have been fine. (laughs) (laughs) Well, that's good news. Wait, what am I putting it there for? Power four. Should I just go for it? I saved up level, so... Hello, llama. Um, Captain, or Thea slash Theo, I would like to complain about the... where can you just put them in the royal stables until you find another home for them? Uh, I'll I'll put them in in there for now. Oh, that's so sad. Oh wait! Oh oh oh! Yeah. <laughs> okay, you've upgraded this. Oh look at the axolotls. Yeah, okay, this is better. Been... Oh my! Yeah, maybe better maybe start. wait till the rain pass. I'll I'll definitely wait till the rain passes. Power four. Well, I got power four, bro. Maybe I'll trade that for infinity. I want infinity. Uh oh. Oh wait. Okay, never mind. Yeah. I have a mending book too. Maybe I'll put that on my bow. Speaking of riptide. I did. I got a power four infinity. I have a power five four. Okay. I have a power five infinity bow. Perfect. And then I'll add mending to it. And I'll have a pretty good bow. Sweet. All right. I just got really lucky. That was really worth it. Thank you. Oh, thank you. Hopefully it does not cost too much to put mending on this. But I do have um I do have a complaint about the skeleton farm. Well, it breaks my swords to punch. So I if I think if we lower the height that the skeletons fall at, yeah, I, then we I, only I, have to I punch have to them once. Too. And we don't have to mm-hmm. ruin our weapons. Whoever wants to do that, otherwise I'll do it myself. But I don't. I'm worried about breaking it. All right, I'm gonna head uh, back to the castle so I can see if I can add mending to also, this bow. Yes. Also, do you like the new design of the area? Ooh, yes I do. This is what I was talking about. Oh, this is your graves. That's very morbid. Okay. Well, I'll pay my respects. <laughs> Oh, I see another house being built over there. The Elven Kingdom is turning out lovely. I'm very excited. Very hard on this place. Yes, I can tell. It looks great. Okay, I'm gonna... I don't know if you're following me, but I'm gonna head back to the castle. And I'm gonna enchant my bow. But I will see you two later. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. Let's go see how many levels this is going to 
cost, I may have to head back to the skeleton farm if it's going to be far too many. But good to know that the mermaids, even if it's not the mermaid princess, they're willing to come. Oops. That is really good. Okay. Here's the mending book. I don't think we have an anvil down here yet, but we should get one relatively soon. Maybe I have not nearly any iron. <laughs> this is pretty sad. I have to go on another mining expedition with everybody. Okay, we're going to use Kano's again. I just hope I don't break his anvil before he returns. I cannot add it to a bow. Maybe because it has infinity on it. Well, never mind. Mending shall not go on that. I guess I will put that on my armor. Alright, I think I might end the episode down here. Never done that before. Changing it up a little bit. Thank you everybody so, so much for watching this episode of Princess SMP. If you made it to the end of the episode, please let me know another name for an axolotl if I find another one. And maybe say what color axolotl it would be for. So, like, for example, if it was a yellow axolotl and its name is Sunny. So type that in the comments below and maybe your name will be my next axolotl. Don't forget to like and subscribe and I will see you in the next one. Bye!